Thanks. And new this morning, another robbery on the CTA. Police say four men cornered a woman on the red line, snatching her cell phone. CBS 2's Eric Cox is live at the Cermak Chinatown stop, where some of the suspects were arrested. Good morning, Eric. Good morning to you, Chris. That's right. Police say two of the young men believed to be behind this cell phone robbery were apprehended here at the Cermak Chinatown Red Line stop overnight. It's one of at least six attacks that happened along a two mile stretch of the Red Line since Sunday. And our nonstop news crew was here a little after 1130 last night at the Cermak Chinatown Red Line stop when police questioned those two young men. In minutes, the suspects were put in cuffs and placed in a police van. The 24-year-old victim says these are just two of the four people who approached her on the red line and took her cell phone. Another one of the young men was arrested after exiting the Monroe stop, but the fourth suspect still on the loose this morning. All six of the recent red line attacks since Sunday have taken place between Roosevelt and Chicago. In another case, a teenager is facing several felonies for punching and robbing a 61-year-old man on New Year's Eve downtown on the red line. Police say that teen was part of a group of 6 to 10 young people who jumped the 61-year-old as well as a 21-year-old man who tried helping him. And these attacks are not limited to the red line. Police telling me that crime is up 2% across the CTA since Thanksgiving, but officers also saying that arrests are up too to the tune of 180 percent. I'm Eric Cox reporting live in Chinatown this morning, CBS 2 News. Eric, thank you.